actually you see the zircon is not matching correctly for the cell parameter. I know the, the, this is the correct zirconia in terms of uh, similar structure, it's only that he has a different uh, content of ceria and the, the cerium atom is quite big and he stretched a lot of the cell. Okay, so uh, here is not matching at all. If you see high angle, we don't match at uh, all what we need. Uh, I work at a lot on zirconia, so I know actually that a good place to check the zirconia, the tetragonal zirconia, is the uh, area around 70 degree over here, because here you see these two peaks here. This is the peak. Uh, the uh, 2 to 0, and here is the 0, 0, 4 peak, okay? So this peak, uh, and you see here, you see the zirconia, it's just that this, and this peak normally is nearly half of this one. And you see, these are the two peaks here, so we are just, uh, only, we need to increase the cell uh, here. So the good thing of using this part, uh, this case is just that this peak here, the 004, uh, it only depends from the C axis, and instead this peak here, 220, depends only on the A axis. So it is more easy to adjust the cell parameter, in this tetragonal zirconia, uh, using one and just see the result only on moving one peak. So I show you how you, we can use. Uh, mouth uh, live to uh, change uh, in real time the parameter and adjust this one. So I go here, for example, I select the, uh, this parameter, the A, if I click over here, not exactly here because otherwise you click also on the small arrow. So here the purpose of this box is that here is the actual value and here is the increment and we can use the arrow to increment the value or uh, decrease the value and we will see a, in real time the program will compute the, the, the fit in here and show uh, the result. So let's say well we select a, a bigger stamp than this one for example we change by 0 0.01 and we need actually to increase as we want to move uh, this the 2 to 0 we need to move this one over here, so let's increase. You see, we are just moving only this peak here, not this one. So it's more easy just to adjust uh, one by one the cell parameter. So actually, we are inside here. Well, if we want to move a little bit more, and then we can change also the C. And now you see that we just change only the C. Okay, now after. Ending with this, I just click elsewhere to get out of this edit box. It, this is actually important, otherwise the program remains stuck on this uh, edit box. Okay, I double click here to see the entire one. And now you see that uh, we are matching much better at low angle also. Also this uh, region here could have been used for this part. Or over here. Okay, now finally what uh, we have adjusted everything okay normally what uh, you can do is also adjust maybe if you want the background is better to so here is our data set the Kurundu zirconia background data set and the data set uh, remember there was the instrument the background the data set so here is the background preliminary coefficient we take the first one the constant part uh, and I change by 10, for example, and you see that I, I just can increase the background. Okay, well, we don't do any more adjustment because I want to show you how we can use the wizard of mouth to just do an automatic analysis. So I select the wizard here, or you just go analysis wizard here. We select the quantitative analysis and we say go. Okay, while well, I adjust this, okay, so I can see this. Uh, five iteration each uh, uh, step uh, and you will do three step uh, one to adjust uh, 
background intensity now is in the second step to adjust uh, peak position and in the third step uh, the program also adjusts uh, peak profiles by refining crystallized size and microstrain now we can check uh, the progress over here you see the fitting is going better and uh, we are nearly to the end okay here it is uh, we actually have 74, nearly 75% and 25. I can uh, say to you this was a, a mixture made exactly with this quantity. So we get uh, exactly a good uh, phase quantification. And here are the RW is just 10 and the goodness of it 1.6. Okay.